Hey, welcome back to 20 Minutes or Less. This is our last story of the day. My name is Elliot Morgan. My name is Lee Newton. All right. I think we take the cameras on our phones for granted. Think about 10 years ago and all the awesome photos you could have taken with you and your friends having a blast at Discovery Zone or all the great poops you could have MMS to your pal Sean. Or you can use your camera phone for something more important like detecting possible skin cancers, which is exactly what this new app for mobile devices created by the researchers from the University of Michigan Health System does. Right, and in order to demonstrate how it works, I need a volunteer to get naked. It's not gonna be me, so I, I guess that would mean it's gonna be Lee. Oh, no, no. I'm not, I'm not gonna get naked. Come on, Lee, okay, it's for science. It's not a big deal. Wait, for science? Why didn't you say that in the first place? It's naked time! So while Lee rocks out in her birthday suit, let's talk a little bit about skin cancer. First off, it's the most common form of cancer in the US with more than 3.5 million skin cancers and over 2 million people being diagnosed annually. Each year there are more new cases of skin cancer than the combined incidences of cancers of the breast, prostate, lung, and colon. And it's also easy to detect yourself as it manifests itself visibly early on. But no matter how long you stare at a mole in the mirror, subtle changes in pre-existing spots or moles that may be melanoma might not be so obvious. That's where this app comes in. Okay. I'm ready, let's do this. The developers are pitching the free app as convenient and cost effective, but it requires a little bit of patience and you can't do it alone. You'll need to strike 23 different poses and you need a partner to line up your body parts with the outlines on the screen, like so. Oh, dear God, Lee, what is that? Oh, that, uh, that's my God-given Tennessee roadmap. I haven't got it checked out, but you know, I feel like I should. This app might be a really good thing, right? Oh, it looks like a nude Lincoln. Oh, I think, see, I see. I see Ronald Reagan. That's disgusting. Okay. Okay, you know what? I don't think we need to uh, demonstrate this app right now. Let's go through this real quick so you can go have that checked out like yesterday. Is that bad? Yes. It's, okay. It's disgusting. All right. Yeah, you know, I like to think of them as like my angel wings that haven't really grown in yet, you know? No. <laughs> it's bad, right? Yeah, I it's should bad. probably get it checked out. Oh, God. Of all the stories to go naked on. All right. The Institute warns that, quote, based on fair though unquantified evidence, visual examination of the skin in asymptomatic individuals may lead to unavoidable increases in harmful consequences. In other words, Miss and overdiagnosis can lead to overtesting for certain cancers, leading to unnecessary interventions and, at worst, serious, serious complications. Right! Okay, so even though it's a free app and it's amazing and could definitely help in finding and preventing early skin cancer, it's still a good idea to go to the doctor if you notice a mole that's growing or changing over a period of time. Like, if it, if it looks like a new Lincoln and now it turns into a Ronald Reagan, you know? Over 90% of melanomas are detectable with the naked eye, and if you do eyeball a suspicious mole, the app has a feature that lets you take and compare multiple pictures side by side while tracking a potential problem over time. Right, just be careful when taking nude photos of yourself and make sure you have a password set on your phone or delete the photos after you've used the app. The last thing you need is your dad stumbling upon the photos while going through your phone with the intentions of yelping for a nearby Arby's. So do you guys think it's too risky to take nude photos on your phone or do you think it's safe as long as you take proper precautions? Also check out the description below for a link to download the app now. And of course, don't forget to click on that like and subscribe button, click the annotation down below or go to sourcefed.com for a five daily stories and guys keep sending us photos of you and your source fed gear we love our wall i'm lee newton i'm ellie morgan speaking of photos do you mind if i tweet this elliot